Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Built-in webcams and cameras on Windows laptops and desktops, as many of you may know, have a LED indicator that basically um, is turned on when you power your camera on and off or your webcam on and off. And on laptops, it's mainly at the top of the screen next to the camera and also on a webcam. It's also a little indicator, LED indicator that will turn on and mainly show a green light in most cases next to the actual camera. Now, in some circumstances, um, some devices do not have an LED that actually shows you when the camera is turned on and that you are using the camera. Or you may have a laptop or a, um, a desktop where that LED is actually maybe broken or isn't being displayed to let you know when you are using your camera and when it is turned on. Now, in case you're unaware, um, Windows 10 and Windows 11 actually have a little notification that is a hidden feature that can be displayed when the camera is turned on and powered on and powered off which um, can be enabled using the registry editor in both operating systems. So in this video, we're going to have a look at how to enable Windows 10 and Windows 11's hidden camera notification that gets displayed on your desktop to let you know when you are using your camera and when that camera is turned on and powered on and powered off. Now to do this, once again, we have to edit the registry. And if you are comfortable to edit the registry, I would suggest just heading to your start menu, right clicking on that, click on run, enter reg edit click on ok and that will open the registry editor and the process is very similar for both windows 10 and windows 11. now as i always suggest um when we fiddle in the registry always export your registry your registry first do a backup so if anything does go wrong or you make a mistake you can always import that backup at a later stage which is just a safety net now um what we have to do is first navigate to H key local machine. So we just click on that and that will expand H key local machine. Then we head over to software, click on that. Microsoft, the same applies. And now we have to scroll down under Microsoft looking for OEM. And here we go, OEM, and we click and expand OEM. And then you must click on device and then capture. Now um, in the right hand pane, you are going to see a value called no physical camera led so what you need to do is double click on that and there you will see i don't know if you can actually see it okay in the video but yeah the value data is set to zero now all we have to do is change that from zero to one and then we click on okay and then what you would do is just close the registry editor and then what i would do is suggest is just to restart your computer which is always good to do after you edit the registry now um because of privacy reasons i've just taken a couple of screenshots to show you that this actually actually works so this these screenshots i took prior to uploading this video and posting this video and yeah you can see i've turned my camera on and after that registry has been edited and i have changed that value i'm just going to zoom in here so you can see it in the video we get that camera on notification and when I turned my camera off, okay, heading to the next screenshot, we get the camera off notification, which I think are handy little features, especially if you don't have a LED indicator telling you and displaying when your camera is on and off. And also maybe you just have a broken LED um, on your built-in camera or on your laptop. And these are just handy options that will just let you know, especially if you're on a live stream, when your camera is turned on and off. And um, if you want to revert the process and reverse the process, um, it's very si uh, simple. You just head back to your registry. So once again, you just right click, run, reg edit, and you just head back to the same. You just follow the steps again, and you just double click on um, no physical camera LED, and you just change that value from one back to zero. Click on OK. You would close your registry then and restart your device, and then that will remove that camera on off notification that will be displayed as a pop-up notification on your desktop so thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one